All right, back at the cemetery. Gonna refly a mission that I failed yesterday. Let's get up there. Zero feet altitude, four feet distance, seven miles per hour, 98% battery. This one is low level, so. Don't need to focus very far away. Got fucking lighting right. There we go. All right. This mission is low level. It's gonna fly a couple feet off the ground in the beginning. It's gonna run laps around the cemetery road here. I tried this yesterday. I hit the fucking five tree. Five miles per hour, ninety-four percent battery. So we'll see what happens if I can make it <laughs> right up there. Hit the tree over here. Changed the path and dropped it down to three feet. See, I'm kind of like interested to see how well these things respond. Uh, see how accurate the GPS is. Fuck. It's hard to see. Over here is where I hit the tree. Went right by the tree. There. Yeah, that's not. <laughs> It cleared it, but eleven feet altitude, two hundred eighty two feet distance, four miles per hour, eighty nine percent battery. Yeah, it's going to fly around at about seven miles an hour, seven feet high. So it just kind of gives you an idea that, yeah, the GPS is accurate, but it's not that accurate. And should stay right in the middle of this road the whole way. And it's doing that for the most part. It doesn't seem to like these turns very well. Let's see how we do over here. Okay. Six feet altitude, two hundred eighteen feet distance. Four miles. So far, so good. Eighty-five percent battery. The altitude's kind of uh, climbing and sinking. Yeah, it looks like what it's what it's doing is it's losing altitude and then it's climbing when it sees an obstacle. So we'll see. How well the the obstacle avoidance is on. Six feet altitude. 217 feet distance, 4 miles per hour, 79% battery. Keep it a steady altitude now. It's kind of doing a big figure S in the inside the cemetery. When it was coming down the road, it was dipping and then rising and then dipping. So here comes uh, 
I just don't want it to get low when you hit a freaking bush or a stone like that. Six feet altitude, 260 feet distance, three miles per hour, 74% battery. Hmm, went up and over. It's not bad. It's doing the absolute uh, obstacle avoidance is doing a pretty decent job. That's interesting. It's keeping it above. It's a little impressive. Well, it seems to be slowing down. Yeah, yesterday it hit the tree branch and I kind of got stuck there because I, I couldn't throw it into uh, <coughs> sport mode quick enough. And instead of going <coughs> down, I, I should have went down, but I went up and it, it flew into the tree more. So Yeah, you're more likely to crash your drone. <laughs> closer you are to the ground, the more problems you can run into. That's why up in the wild blue, it's pretty safe. Now it's going to go turn, come back around, and down the behind the trees. This should be okay. See it? That's good because it saw the tree and avoided it. There again. Six feet altitude. 337 feet distance, 4 miles per hour, 65% battery. Now it's just going to cruise around this field. And there were just some hood rats back here, they took off. I mean, the thing is right in front of me, and I can't see it. I hear it. Oh, there it is. Just chugging along. Flying nice and steady right there. Six feet altitude, 62 feet distance, three miles per hour, 60% battery. Basically going to go up to the tree line and just kind of turn. There were just a bunch of hood rats over here too. They took off. The fucking coots. So far so good. It's just uh, it's that one turn up here it didn't like too much. The one near the, the big trees. It's keeping a good altitude. Six feet. Uh, following Six GPS feet altitude, nicely distance, four miles per hour 56 percent battery I know exactly where it is I looked down at my iPad I looked back up and I lost sight of it even though it's right in front of me oh I see it now This is where I saw the uh, coyote last week. He was following some hood rats around. Right here is where I spotted him. Six 
6 feet altitude, 370 feet distance, 4 miles per hour, 51% battery. I see it now. Yeah, just low and slow is using a good amount of battery. Thing is pretty stealth, I'll tell you. It, if I didn't know where it was, I wouldn't have no another hood rat just popped up. I would have no idea where to look for it. Six feet altitude, 453 feet distance, three miles per hour, 45% battery. See his shadow. After I leave here, I'm going to go up near uh, Route 4 and fly over Walmart. I ain't been out there in a while. Then I got to go to the grocery store. I have to buy my dog chicken because she's old and she doesn't eat dog food anymore. I have to make her chicken dinner every night. I boil up a big vat of rice and keep it in the fridge. And I throw some chicken in the hot air fryer. Some I buy the chicken Six thighs. Cut the bone distance. out and Three miles per hour. cook it in the chicken in the hot air fryer. It does a great job and chop it up and give it to her. She's done. It doesn't make her, she doesn't throw it up and she doesn't poop butter all over the place so it's it works right now the only reason I can see it is because of the orange uh, the orange uh, wrap I got on the battery I put that on there on purpose too you lose your drone I see guys put camouflage skin it's like what is the matter with you how do you expect to find it if it crashes and you don't have a GPS tracker on it you'll never find it <laughs> six feet altitude 286 feet distance two miles per hour 36 percent battery you'll never find it <laughs> Hood rat was just out there. He just took off. Not very interesting, but it's uh, kind of cool to watch it out there. Flying around nice and stable. It's supposed to climb to 20 feet here. There it goes. It stopped a second. Might be the sun. Yeah, it's the sun. It thinks the sun is an obstacle. I'll watch it. You can see it stopping. Three miles per hour. Thirty-one percent battery. So the sensors are working great. This is supposed to climb to twenty feet. Why is it not? Never climbed to 20 feet. That's weird. Mission ended. Huh. I don't know why it didn't climb to 20 feet. But, otherwise, that was 
really cool. Six feet altitude, 46 feet distance, four miles per hour, 26% battery. Warning, aircraft battery at 25%. The old glory up close. Warning, aircraft battery at twenty three per cent. I'll bring it home, even though it's home. Cancel the landing. Now that should have went up to 200 feet. I don't know why it didn't. Warning, aircraft battery at 18%. Let me go out here and see what happens if it, if it goes back up. Sixty-three feet altitude, one hundred thirty-three feet distance, six miles per oh, hour. Fifteen percent battery. Warning: aircraft battery at fourteen percent. It's coming down now. <laughs> I don't know why. Maybe it, you're in a certain distance. It doesn't go to the return to home altitude. Aircraft battery at 11%. I don't know. You think you got these things figured out? And you don't. Seventy-seven feet altitude. Nine feet distance, two miles per hour, nine percent battery. Warning, aircraft battery at nine percent. All right. <laughs> yeah, just when you think you know everything, you realize you don't know shit. But that was interesting. I didn't hit the tree again this time. It was slow and low. I like the way it behaved. Uh, we saw obstacles in the cemetery. It was actually climbing and and, and sinking again. So that's kind of cool. Good to know. So that's the first time I ever flew a mission like that, that low to the ground and that slow. So it was neat. Anyways, I'm done fucking talking. D-dub out.